Jane Perez, and I'm an astrophysicist, and this is what happens to the gravitational force between two planets when the distance between them is increased to three times its previous value. So let's say that the first, uh, let's look at the gravitational force first. For the first planet, it will be the gravitational constant g, the mass of the first planet, the mass of the second planet, and the distance and then let's say that we increased the distance, but we kept everything else the same. So the mass didn't, the masses didn't change, just the distance increased. So now instead of, we'll call this d2, and it's three times d1. Now let's plug in our force equation. So we have g and one, the mass of the second planet. And now instead of the distance d1, we have the distance d2, which is three, d1 square. So now we have one ninth of the original force because we had to square the three of the distance. So even when we just change the distance size, what it does, it drops the, gravita the gravitational uh, force by the square of it. So we have one ninth of the force of the previous force. My name is Eileen Perez and I'm an astrophysicist and this is what happens to the gravitational force between two planets when the distance changes.